Every week here at ABC Action News, we hear from the hardworking people of Tampa Bay, like spending thousands of dollars on a used car that broke down hours or days after leaving the lot. Taking Action reporter Jackie Calloway shows us why people in other states are protected from this, and you're not. He paid $3,000 cash for the used Toyota, which now sits abandoned in the front yard. The engine died 13 miles after Jesse Napier left the used car dealer's lot. It's broken down on me at least three times. I really just want my money back. But the dealer told Jesse, tough luck. You bought it as is. Elonia Taylor's SUV broke down two weeks after buying it from another dealer. She got the same answer. You bought the car as is. No warranty on the car. It's your problem. And that's your problem. If Alonia and Jesse bought their vehicles in 19 other states, they would not be stuck with lemons because of laws protecting buyers. They at least provide some limited protections. Florida has nothing like that at all. Six states have used car lemon laws. If a dealer can't fix the vehicle the first 60 days, it must refund or replace it. 13 other states have limited protections that require a warranty. Arizona's is bare bones. A dealer must make major repairs in the first 15 days. Even that would have protected Jesse. It's just unsettling that somebody would do that to people who are in desperate need. It's customers at some buy here, pay here lots who are at the highest risk, who need lemon or warranty protection. But many consumer experts say that won't happen here because of a powerful used car lobby. It's a political problem in Florida. The car dealers uh, have too many legislators up in Tallahassee in their pockets. Used car lemon laws cover replacement and repairs between 30 and 90 days, depending on the state. But in Florida, well, your only real protection is to get an inspection on your used ride before you sign on the dotted line. I'm Jackie Calloway, taking action for you.